Hello everyone, welcome back to American Truck Some Letter. So we're getting here guys doing some back-to-back -back videos. I uh, just wrapped up a video using the next generation uh, let me get, I'm trying to get my map back. Sorry about that. Just wrapped up a video with the next generation uh, Peterbilt. We're gonna do one now another one with the uh, next generation T680 Kenworth We got some tires some Volvo tires here on the flatbed We got 110 miles to go so I've been, I've been working on the sound, guys, trying to get the sound adjusted. Uh, the truck's running at a pack car engine, uh, 415 horsepower. So here's the inside of the Kenworth. Go ahead and close up that mount. And we hit the wrong button already. Get out of the way. Here's the inside of the next generation Kenworth. Uh, I do like the front end a little bit better on the Peterbilt, for my opinion, but, um, Everyone has their own opinion about the truck, but I like the Peterbilt a little bit better on the front. It looks a little bit more aggressive to me, but let's go route. Glad to get a thumbnail. Guys, let me know about the audio. I'm still working on trying to get everything adjusted for uh, making it where it's not too loud, you know. I definitely want to hear the feedback about it. Probably never get out of here. This is one thing that they still have not fixed. You have to. Uh, kind of force your way out. I'm going to get out. I'm very surprised. Make that turn. Eventually, guys, we'll see these trucks come to ATS from SS. And who knows? We may get one of them this year. You know, I mean, we know that they're working on the International 9900i. For a truck like he is, or something you don't hear too much. Turn left. Let it turn. We're going to go ahead and get a thumbnail. Now, I run this truck a little bit earlier, but I haven't run. I didn't run a good run with it, so I wanted to run it, run it again. Uh, uh, the truck looks good, but I just like the front of the Peterbilt better myself. Okay, I think that'll work.
little bit of lag. I'm uh, still looking into that. Need to turn right. I'm beginning to think it's some of these traffic mods causing problems. Turn right. Trailer pack guys, uh, um, Nick's uh, trailer pack. It's a uh, has multiple different. Um, no, it's the Godfather trailer pack. It has multiple different um, trailer textures like that that you'll see in traffic. You can't haul them, but you can see them in traffic. That engine sound terrible. We're gonna turn that down if we can. It's way too loud. Let's see. I can't handle that engine sound being that loud. Let's see. No, turn it down a little bit more. I know it's too loud for you guys, too. That's a little bit better, I believe. Not near as loud. As it was. It's way too loud. Yeah, I'm using a trailer pack that's uh, from The Godfather. It uh, gives you multiple different trailer uh, paint jobs and stuff in traffic. We're gonna, we're gonna go across the scale. Yeah, that's a lot better. It was way too loud. Okay, let's find a new rail. All right, sixty two thousand six hundred and thirty seven pounds. Sorry about that guy with the engine sound. I, yeah, I think that's a lot better.
you just kind of take, uh, take a look at this beautiful truck, along with the uh, right. Peterbilt we used to run. Right. Still a little bit loud, but it's not near loud as it was. Turn right. I got, I got this truck off of modsites.com. Uh, it has not been updated for 1.4.3. 1. Uh, 1. It has been updated for 1.4.2, but it still works fine. Um, I don't run a lot of modded trucks, so you don't see a lot of modded trucks over here, but these two trucks caught my eye. This one and the, the, uh, the 579. Uh, I, wanted to get, I definitely wanted to run one with these, both of these trucks. <coughs> Well, like we're taking it to the construction site right here. It was a nice ride. Now, make sure you come back and visit me, all right? All right where do I turn around? wasn't aware we was taking it to this, to this construction area. Uh, I can blow too. You can wait. Still gonna be a little bit off here. Let's see here. We can do. One thing SCS needs to do is they need to do something to track.
All right, we drove extra. We drove 109 miles. Took us three hours, 53 minutes. Get 59 minutes. To get here. We can save 15.1 gallon of fuel. All right, guys, that's gonna be it for the run with this uh, with the next generation T680. We'll get in here and show y'all what this truck will be. Uh, eventually, we'll probably get this from SCF, so I'm, I'm pretty sure they are working on these trucks. Uh, they're probably in the works. Uh, awesome mod, uh, has great sounds, uh, looks really good. Uh, me, myself, uh, like I said, I do like the Peterbilt a little bit better. I think it has a little bit better front end. And I do apologize for the sound. Uh, I'm trying to dial that thing back down. I, like I said, I had to get a new headset. So everything is a little bit different with this headset. I'm adjusting it from the word sound as good as the other one did. So thank you for everyone for watching the video. Thank you for everyone for subscribing. And uh, have a good day.